Greetings, beloved beings of light. Hope you're having a most beautiful, blessed day. Just want to give you a couple quick updates, make this as brief as possible with these powerful, intense energies coming in. I hope you had a most beautiful, blessed, and sacred 9-11 portal. I know it was very fiery and intense for us. Just wanted to let you all know, uh, yesterday our Facebook account was hacked. We've been locked out of it. I tried all day yesterday to get back in. It looks like we will not be able to. I know many of you that follow this channel are also connected to me on Facebook under Paul White Gold Eagle. That account has been hacked and we will not be able to get access. We tried contacting Facebook. They have no support, obviously, and we tried every security measure to no avail. So it looks like we will not be able to get back on there. And we know thousands of you that uh, many of you that follow, we had uh, up to, I think, 4,000 connections on there and 30,000 followers. That's all gone in the blink of an eye, a lesson in impermanence, uh, whichever, we let it go. But I just want to let you know, because we were hacked, uh, that you may be getting contacted by this person that hacked our account. That's what they do once they hack these predators and parasites, once they hack into an account. And we had every security measure uh, possible. I don't know how they got through it, but they do. They just hammer it, hammer it, hammer it. We've noticed over the last week, every day, I was getting notifications that the password was trying to be changed. I kept notifying Facebook. They obviously did nothing. So here we are today. And as of now, I don't plan on opening a new account. So if you receive any messages from Paul White Gold Eagle or myself or someone impersonating me, what they do once they hack into an account, they'll blast out spam messages to everyone in your contacts. So if you receive a message, I never contact anyone for to purchase anything or to, what they try to do is to send you um, ads to purchase things or to get money from you. They ask you for money. I never do that. The only time we ask for um, donations is through our YouTube videos and our posts and stuff like that. We never directly contact anyone. So if s someone claiming to me contacts you directly, just report them, block them, whatever. But it's not us. And like I said, I don't plan on getting back on Facebook. If I do, it's just to connect and get information from our uh, newer scribes and that. So it was too complicated and a mess anyways with these social media. So if you could let our people know, please share this video um, all over social media, Facebook. Let, let everyone know that that account was hacked so I'll no longer obviously be able to update those pages. Uh, Prime Disclosure, Paul White Gold Eagle and whatnot on Facebook. So thank you all very much. Uh, please share this all over uh, social media. Let our people know that if they are contacted by me, just to block them. And if you're contacted, uh, sorry for the inconvenience, but we're doing the best we can. So now let's, I also wanted to talk to you about, this is the main reason just to let you all know we've been hacked and I'll no longer be posting on uh, Facebook. So you'll just have to get all our updates from uh, YouTube, our website, primedisclosure.com, or our Patreon page. And they're also been trying to hack into several of my other accounts, my YouTube account. So hopefully we, we've got that totally secured. I'm trying to keep them from shutting down our YouTube channels. And you know, the dark is trying everything they can to stop us. They cannot stop us. All they can do is slow down this ascension process and slow down our uh, awakening, you know, as we get more and more people to come in and experience this ascension process and the knowledge of this great awakening, the quicker this process is going to happen. So they're doing everything in their power, the false ones, the psychopaths that run this false game that we're all involved in, you know, that we're resolving here and now. And through this powerful portal yesterday, I know I felt uh, many of you too, the, uh, our atoms feel like on fire even to uh, last couple days. And today I could smell, you know, in my senses, in the sense of smell, like the world is on fire. And obviously we're experiencing in this external realm, all these fires around the world, but this is the internal fire, the internal mirror, the external, external mirror, 
the internal as the collective. This is a collective process now. We all went through our individual shifts, purges, releases, letting go. Now this is for the collective. So we continue through and through and through this ascension process. And we've been receiving messages from people. They're going to make it through. And I just want to let you all know, do not worry. Do not fear uh, about this whole process. Uh, our people, my queen and I, did not come into this realm to leave any of you behind in this ascension. So don't worry about that. We got you covered. Just keep holding the faith, holding the line, holding the light, your visions for the new earth. And we'll see this through together. We're all in this together. It's a collective experience. We have our individual experience and our collective. What else I wanted to transmit to you in this special video? Is there a pairs? There's a high probability we're going to go through a transition before the event. Now, people ask me every day, when is the event? When are the med beds coming? All these things. Um, I'm very busy, so I can't respond to most comments, emails, this and that. I connect with our uh, closest team, and I do my best to uh, communicate and contact, respond to emails, all these things. But I'm working 10 hours a day, seven days a week, so I'm doing the best I can. I'm one person doing many tasks in this uh, great mission of Liberation Earth. So. Uh, there's a high probability we're seeing a transition. We are in the transition now, but many of our people are suffering greatly all over this realm. So part of this transition, and this is a probability, this isn't a definite. The event may come before this transition or during the transition or after. We don't know. No one in this realm, no living being knows the day, time. We all know through all the traditions and all of our prophecies that no no one knows the exact day time there's no date set we just know once we uh, reach critical mass we're in critical mass now of this awakening our 144,000 are gathering all over this realm and we're all stationed in special key portals uh, along the ley lines of mother earth so part of this transition, our people need to be freed from the Babylonian debt slavery system. That is first. Now, I can't guarantee this will come first before the event or, or after, but obviously after the event, once we're in 5D, there's going to be no need for currency, for money. Currency is, our currency is going to be love and art, you know. <laughs> That's what we're transitioning to. Knowledge, love, truth, art, our creativity is going to have the true value. This is a the true <laughs> currency of the new earth so until we're fully embodied obviously 5d is anchored in now i have been fully conscious into 5d and it is beautiful beyond what you can imagine we'll say the best words i can come up with is everything is pure energy pure light and pure beauty it's beyond even what the mind can imagine until you experience experience 5d fully consciously now yes 5d is fully anchored in and we're bringing in the energies of 6d 9d all the way to 12d 12d is uh my sacred condor and i that's where we lowered our soul star spark from is the 12th dimension into this uh, third density so that 12th is what we say closest to source. Now we can go into these higher dimensions above all that, but that's beyond even physical form, any kind of uh, form in itself, you know, physical and non-physical, you know, form, formless, whatever. So part of this transition, freeing humanity, we have many of our people suffering, many of our people are homeless all over this realm. It's a beautiful breeze coming through town here. Many of our wing nations are around us, Walela, and many of our angels. So part of this transition, many of our people homeless, starving, all these nonsensical things. If we all join together in our concerted effort of raising the frequency and working for each other in service to all of humanity, this will shift in an instant. So we have many of our people suffering. So part of this is freeing humanity from this Babylonian debt slavery system and from all slavery systems. So we're doing this together and we obviously have the Earth Alliance and many of our people working towards uh, freeing humanity from the slavery systems. 
so freeing uh, from this debt slavery and freeing from mental slavery, these mind control programs that are running constantly through uh, technologies and devices. I've covered this in past uh, Dharma talks about the black box, you know, this scrying mirror. It's neutral and what can come through is great beauty or the great sword in this, the great conflict. So we're resolving all these things in these final days of the false 3D matrix. So we're seeing that there's going to be this transition and many ask about the med beds. It's being reported now. We're getting information coming in. The med beds are in place. But what is going to happen before they're released to the public and we're in this transition is based on the laws of thermodynamics and the law of entropy, a closed system. You see, the earth is a closed system, meaning that you and I can't come and go at will. We're within the system and a closed system. Either systems, you know, like the earth system or biological systems, all these things. There's closed systems and open. Closed means everything is self-sustained within the system and an open system, external things can come in. So we are shifting from a closed system to an open system and part of this transition is uh, connecting with our star families our star nations that's part of our mission to awaken humanity to these are our families and friends from the stars that are going to help us convert this realm from a closed system to an open system just like you came from a closed heart and now you're opening your heart this is the expansion this is going from a closed system to open meaning Ex infinite expansion, infinite possibilities, infinite dimensions. So we go from limitation to unlimited reality, unlimited potential, unlimited possibilities you see in this now. And that's what we're shifting to. So if you really contemplate, really think about this for a moment, meditate on this about what would happen if these med beds that can reverse aging, stop aging, make you live for hundreds of years, what would happen to this closed system that's limited on resources? You go from 8 billion to 16 billion to 32 billion. Now I've taught this in the past through different channels and behind the scenes and on Patreon and that. So this is first I transmit, but let you use your own discernment and really contemplate knowing that the system there's only so much land to live so much food to give so much water to take i know that's very very vast but there's still a limitation to all closed systems there's only so much farmland there's only so much food there's only so much uh, water i know we have lots of water but there's only so much land for people to live on so until we can turn into open system then we can shift this and this could be either through technology or shift in consciousness to where we can come and go in things like bilocation or teleportation or coming and going on ships, however you see it. Now, we're seeing this coming through in many ways. So whatever resonates with you, you know, go with that, go with that vision and know that we're very close to shifting from a closed system to open. And once we do, then these things can be released. You know, this is all part of disclosure, which we talk about almost every day, this disclosure, disclosure of that which is hidden, the revelation and disclosure of our star nations, our star families, the sky beings, you know, whatever you want to call extraterrestrial, that which is beyond this realm that has the technology and ability to come and go at will you know, into uh, open systems, these systems all over the universe that are connected through these wormholes, the singularity at the center of each sun are Einstein Rosen bridges, Einstein Rosen bridge, it's a wormhole that connects through time and space portals. It's like folding time and space so there's no distance between point A and point B. It's very complex and complicated, but you get my drift. You know, this is also based on quantum physics. Oh, light rain just came to cool down. Beautiful. There's a beautiful smell in the air. So really feel into this energy, let it go. Again, I'm going to end this so I can get this out to you as soon as possible. And uh, let all our people know if you're one of my friends or connections on Facebook or follow us there. Please post this on Facebook. Let everyone know. Let our people know that uh, 
you know, that account's been hacked, so uh, I don't want people to worry too because I they're used to seeing my updates every day on there and I'm no longer going to be able to do that and unless if some miracle happens where I can get back in my account, but I did everything I can in this now. I'll let you all know if for some reason I get back in and can start posting there again, but until then, thank you all very much. We appreciate each and every one of you. We appreciate all the support you're giving us financially, emotionally, spiritually, mentally, you know, all these things. And we appreciate all of you that continue to support us in our work and mission. So please uh, like this video, comment, share it uh, with your teams and tribes, and please post this all over Facebook so all our people on there know, you know, that this event has happened where we were hacked and you know we'll keep you up to date and let you know we'll put this also on our newsletter please send it for our newsletter in case if something happens uh, to our youtube channel they're throwing everything at us in these last days but we keep going through and through and through and i'll keep showing up as long as i can for you each and every day and putting out our daily transmissions and special teachings and trainings and we'll keep uh doing the meditations and trainings on Patreon and YouTube memberships. So join us there on whitegoldeagle.com. And we send you so much love and blessings and bliss in the light of the new heaven upon the new earth. Namaste. Aho.